Sometimes what's good on a blueprint is not right in the physical space. Here are two examples from our Greenwich, Connecticut project. I'm on the second floor where the framers have been busy putting up walls. I like to come here when compressors and nail guns are turned off. The site is quiet and I can review details with a critical eye. That's how I discovered two important changes that now seem so obvious, but nobody, including myself, picked them up before. These two bedrooms share a bath, but look where the entrance door is located. You have to come down this hallway before you can turn to get to the sink and the toilet and it's right next to the master bedroom. It should be easy to get to the sink and the toilet. The bathroom door should be close. It's a simple fix now. Shift the entrance door and move one partition wall and you will have flipped the bathroom layout. It took a carpenter a half an hour, literally, and the impact is huge. Now this bath is easily accessible from both bedrooms. This house has two areas, the main section and an angled garage wing. The architect thought of this area as part of the garage wing. They called it additional storage space or mechanical space. In real life, however, it's much more valuable. It works perfectly as a closet for this bedroom. It was there all along, but simply thought of in a different framework. Change your thinking and gain super valuable space. Corrections are easy to make now. It's simply moving around some lumber. Be a detective during framing. Ask yourself, do bedrooms, closets, hallways, stairs, for example, feel right? Do the proportions work? Is there good flow?